Hey guys, what is up the Neocubist here? Welcome to episode number 10 of my Minecraft Survival Let's Play. A special episode, we're on to the teens now. Well, not technically yet, but we're on episode 10. In the last episode, we started this beautiful greenhouse over here. And uh, we also got some double trees growing, which I did in between um, episode 8 and 9. Either way, we got double trees going. Our greenhouse is going beautifully. And then we also did some home improvement, which you, I'm not going to show you just yet. If you want to go see that, go watch the other episode right now before you watch this one. You don't want to you don't want to get out of order here. And, but yeah, this one's going to be an exciting episode, so be sure to stick around. So it's not the biggest greenhouse in the world. And here's the thing. I think I'm going to do like a multiple greenhouse thing. Like I'm going to put more than one. I'm not exactly sure yet, so, so don't, don't, don't get too excited. Um, because we don't, we don't have that much glass. We have 39 glass left, but I'm going to go back in the house. So for those of you who went back and watched, welcome to this episode. For those of you who didn't, you're like, you're like, Neo, what are you talking about? Just ignore me. We had, we had some snow happen. Um, I want to keep my house at least somewhat snow cleared. So we're just going to, we're going to do this and then we're just going to throw all the snow off the edge. Okay. <laughs> that did not work as intended. You know, we'll do hyper throws. Okay. Let's get inside. Let's see. How much glass do we have smelting? We also, I mean, this is the home improvement we did, by the way. So if you want to go watch that, do it. If you don't, don't. Really not that big of a deal. But look, we got a ton of glass going. Probably more than we're ever going to need. We have a ton of extra sand still. Um, probably like five or six stacks. So you know what? I think we're going to be in an okay position if we want to make multiple greenhouses. Um, I think just two. When I say multiple, I think just two is fine. Also... I had this little thing going right here, but I guess I never put anything in it. So you know what? Check that out. Pretty cool. Uh, where's my plant chest? But yeah, now we got some spruce saplings. Looking, looking pretty good. Oh no. I don't want to get too many snowballs because I'll go snow crazy. I'll just start throwing them. It's not good. Don't, don't, don't catch me with the whole bag of snowballs because you will lose. I'm kidding. I don't think I've ever been in a real snowball fight. I know I've done it with my brother when I was a little kid. We kind of threw some snowballs around, but it wasn't like a proper build a fort and then throw snow at each other. Because, you know, I grew up in Oklahoma. I'm still here, by the way. But there's just not that much snow here, so I didn't really have anywhere to practice necessarily. So, I don't know. Maybe at some point, you know, I'd, I'd like to have some real snow battles. But I think for right now, I, I don't I don't think I'm ever going to have a snow battle. And I know this is just a complete waste of glass to build up with it. So I'm going to put wood in my inventory so I don't get lazy and do that. Okay, so my structure literally is just three. And then it's just three. Like that. So it's nothing fancy. I also need to grab some water. Like this. So one thing about these slabs is they prevent the water from freezing, which is a good thing. Because, um, you know, normally that water would all just freeze, which is not, you know, the best thing in the world. But, hey, you can only do so much to prevent it. Only you can prevent wildfire. Only you can prevent ice from forming in your Minecraft world on version 1.15.2. Which, the update did happen, so we're on 1.15.2. I don't know if that means anything to any of you, but... We're on 1.15.2, so that's a good thing, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I figure two of these should be enough. I don't think we're going to need more. Um, if we do, that's okay. Um, I found an area in the world that has a ton of sand. It's a snowy beach biome. So you'd think it'd be a desert if there's a ton of sand, but no, it's a snowy beach biome. I didn't know there was different kinds of beaches. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Dude. <laughs> Why was that torturous on like at the corner of every single block in the vicinity? Well, that's kind of frustrating. You know what? We lost four glass, but you know, it was a noble death, I guess. I don't know what makes a, no a glass's death noble, but man, sometimes having torches in your offhand is uh, kind of annoying because they get placed whenever you run out of a stack of things. Okay, so we're done with that. Uh, we might need, first of all, before we do anything, we're going to need a crafting table. Now, I don't know how this double greenhouse thing is going to work yet, but I think that's part of the fun. We get to figure out how it works on the fly. So we'll do a couple of slabs. I say a couple, and I just make a ridiculous amount. Also, this guy, I, I really don't want that strip log. I don't know. Strip logs just never really did it for me. I don't know. It's just something about them. They just look weird, I guess. 
I don't know. I think it, if I used them in a build, maybe, then I'd like them more. But I've honestly never used a stripped log in a build that I can remember. I probably have at some point, let's be honest. I've built so many how You guys don't understand. So for the first probably five or six years I did YouTube, I literally only did tutorials. I may have done like a one-off video or something, but mainly it was all tutorials. So you've got to understand, I've built just just too many things. <laughs> I've built too many things, and it's really fun to do it on survival now. Um... Okay, so obviously I don't have like the actual greenhouse part done yet, like in the middle, you know, that you know the whole the whole point of the build, you know, to grow sugar cane. I don't have that done yet. I'm gonna design the outside first. I say that, but I'm, I'm lying. I'm actually gonna do this. It's gonna bother me if I do it out of order, cause all that time wasted where sugarcane could have been growing, not good. It's called time theft, Jim. Time theft is a f is an is an offense. I think. Is that, am I remembering that quote right? I don't know. My girlfriend's really good about that. I can't remember anything from any show. I've, I watched The Office like probably seven times now. And I still cannot remember anything from it. I just don't. And like famous people, I, I don't, I literally, I, I'm not just saying this like to, I don't know. I don't, I don't know any famous people. Like I may know like, like a couple but, like, I don't know a lot of famous people. Like, people be in movies and stuff. They're like, oh, that's blah, 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 blah. They're like, blah, he's so blah, blah. I'm like, what? <laughs> I don't know these people. Like, I've literally, like, I don't I don't know. I don't know why people memorize other people who they don't know. I don't know. I think it's... My girlfriend explains it. She says, well, you see someone so many times at so many different things, you just kind of remember their name. And I'm like, you know what? That makes sense. But my brain doesn't work like that. It's just like, hee-haw, Minecraft, uh... Pixel block, um, uh, yeah. All right. Enough of trying to explain how my brain works. Let's figure out how we're gonna build this base. First of all, these double trees are huge, dude. I'm never gonna need that much wood. Look at these. They would be nice for a treehouse, though. Uh, but when I mine these, I'll probably have like five or six more stacks of wood. I already have like a bunch. I, I have I have too much wood right now. I don't need any more. And we're finally out. Oh, no, we're not out of meat yet. We got fish. Um, I was going to say, we're going to have to make bread finally with our uh, giant bread farm. Well, it's technically a wheat farm, but I'm going to call it a bread farm. Is my FOV right? Yeah. I thought it was on something lower for some reason. Can we finish this guy out? Ah, come on, dude. Can one piece please grow very quickly for me? And as soon as I shut the camera off, look. It grew. Like, literally, I pressed I pressed my hotkey, which is F12, and then it just appeared, and I was like, really? Okay, so... I want to tie these together. I need to figure out the length. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, they're 23 long, so we can do a... Every other one, or we can do like a skip three type deal. Skip three. And now I think we can. You know what? L let me confirm this before I do it along the whole thing. So there's two on the edge there. Nah, we can't. I mean, we could. We just have to extend it. Uh, well, actually, how much wood would we have to extend it? If I wanted it to be... Would it be like this? And then I could... And then there'd be a three... Yeah, okay. That's fine. I don't mind extending it all too. That's really not bad. I thought it was going to be some insane number. You can probably hear the Loki yelping now. He's the he's the young cat in the in the family. I'm not like one of those weird cat people. I just... I really, Here's the thing. Growing up, I always, I always wanted my own pet. But my parents had, have, had pets when they first got married. So they're like, oh, you know, we're tired of having pets. And I was like, okay, that's fine. I understand. You know, I was a kid. I didn't really understand. But now I understand. Um, so there's two cats in my apartment. One is my girlfriend's kind of, like, one is, like, considered my girlfriend's. Then one is mine. But we still both consider them ours. Like, honestly. But we know we're young, you know. Anyways. So basically, um, I got a cat because I live in an apartment. And I don't think an apartment is a very good life for a dog. I mean, maybe for some dogs. But, like... I want my uh, I want my animals to be very happy, uh, so I decided you know what we're gonna get cats and th this looks really good by the way I'm liking this, um, so yeah that's why I have cats I I definitely I 
I don't know. See, I, th I think I like dogs more, but now that I've owned cats, I sort of see the appeal. Like, they're really sweet sometimes. It could be a little crazy. Um, you know, all, all animals could be a little crazy. Um, but I wouldn't consider myself like a crazy cat person. I, it's not like I grew up and I always dreamed of having cats. I always wanted a dog, but then I moved into an apartment and I'm like, this is no life for a dog. So I got a cat. Because cats don't mind as much. You know, they're, they're just happy to be out of that cage that they were in. Because there's too many cats right now. Okay. Anyways, enough talking. I've built up here like four times and I keep coming back down. But it's for good reason. I've just been talking and designing. That's the best. That, that's that's the method for me. So first of all, that looks really cool. I am a huge fan of that. Uh, however, I think what I'm going to need to do to improve this build tenfold is uh, do a little bit of interlacing. Um, so what I mean with that is... See, that's kind of complicated. I think we're going to go up one. Yeah. I think that's what we're going to do. So every three blocks. Yeah, we're just going to add one. Yeah, just add one on each row. Seems easy enough. So every three blocks, just like that. Every three, boom, 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 boom. That's a pretty easy thing to remember. I think I can do that on the other one too. And then boom, 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 boom. So what this is going to do is it's going to give the illusion of like bilateral supports. I don't know if bilateral is the right word, but we're going to go with it. Bilateral supports. Someone who's smart, let me know. Is that the right word? Bilateral supports. So bi would mean two. Lateral up and down. Straight line. I don't know. Two straight. I don't know what bilateral supports are, but we're going to call these bilateral. Um, okay, so see, that looks good, but I want them to be connected more. So we'll, we'll devise some way to connect them because um, obviously in the middle, you know, <laughs> In the middle, they don't have anything. It's just like a, a, a gap in between them. But I want them to feel part of uh, one family. So let me think, which you know, I won't take too long to think, I promise. Um, but from the front, you know, it, it can look a little odd. Uh, but when you look at it from the side, it all sort of comes together. It makes sense. Um, hmm. What can I add to the middle of this that would make it look a little bit better? One, two, three, four, five. Maybe something like this. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, it's six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Actually, you know what? This is going to work. One, two, three, four, five, six. I just need to make some fence. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then once I make fence, um, um, I think what I'm going to do is, I don't know. You guys will see in a second. You guys quit rushing me, guys. I'm just kidding. I know you're not rushing me. Uh, okay, so we're going to put these bad balonies up here, just like this. Oh, we did it. Haha, <laughs> we're, we're MLG pros now. Ow, okay. Uh, hopefully, we don't. no one falls in, into this area. Uh, one thing is, that's not really lit up in there. Mm, it's okay. Um, and then we're going to take some fenciones. Oh, we already have fenciones. Okay, good. Is that how you say fence in uh, Portuguese? Just kidding. Someone said I spoke Portuguese. I didn't click on the timestamp they provided just because I was, you know, there was like 400 comments. So I was kind of in a hurry. But someone said I spoke Portuguese. And I'm like, what? I failed Spanish one. <laughs> All I can say is, uh, mi ama li, mi gusta chicken, or I think chick, mi gusta, wait, what is beef? It's, uh, I don't want to offend anyone. I'm trying to remember what beef is, dude. I feel like I do remember. I'm getting a bad rap here because I can't remember just this one second. Um, it's carne. Yeah, me 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 gusta carne. Um, mi perro es rojo y azul. My dog is red and blue. That's the extent of my uh of my knowledge. I don't know. I don't know much more beyond that. Anyways, so I've just been talking, designing this, so we look at it from afar. It looks pretty cool. Something needs to be done about the front, uh, which is the only problem I'm having. I'm just kind of trying to avoid it so I don't think about it, um, but I don't know what I'm going to do with the front of this thing. I really don't. Um, okay, good. We have more dirt. I was going to say, I want to extend this area a little bit. It's getting a little bit cramped if that's going to be where the entrances are. So we always get to this point in a build where I'm like, we're, we're so close. We're, we're at the end here. I just don't know how to finish it out. Can I hit the squid from here? 
Yes, I can. It's kind of messed up. I remember the first time I got snowballs. Um, it was kind of insane. There seem to be a lot of squid that spawn here and just die. I'm, I'm not killing them, am I? I think I'm knocking them out of the water. Go back in. You got this, Roger. Get back in the... Oh, man. <laughs> but yeah, a lot of squid spawn here and then they get stuck. You're stuck, buddy. You know what? We're going to help you out here. I'm going to give you the special treatment. Anyone else stuck? Well, he was... Bob was stuck, but he died. How do snowballs go underwater? Someone explain that to me. I need a TED Talk on underwater snowballs. Okay, I'm getting distracted again. Uh, okay, first of all, we need doors. Okay, that's kind of necessary. So, let's make a few more planks. Let's also clean this up a little bit. Okay, so a set of doors. We're going to need... I think two on each side. Obviously, the doors are going to go like right here-ish. Hmm. Okay, yeah. I think the best way for this to look good is going to be to sort of like blop it out a little bit like this. That doesn't make any sense. But I hope, hopefully you guys understand what I'm saying. Sometimes I say things. And I know, I know, you know, deep down that they don't really make sense. But you, you can get the meaning across with the wrong words. So, just excuse me while I blop out the, the edges, just, just to give them a little bit more depth. And, uh, yeah, I want both sides to have entrances. Is it necessary? No. Will I ever use the back entrances? Probably not. But, it's just there for redundancy's sake. Uh, reciprocity is important, I believe, especially with doors. Okay, so it's nice and warm in here now. The sugar cane's making a lot of humidity. Um, so it's nice and warm in here. We do need to leave this area open, and I will tell you why right now. Right after this sponsored mess, I'm just kidding. What if an ad break was right there, though? That would be kind of mean. I, I don't know. I, here's the thing, guys. Some people say, you know, Neo, you have too many ads. But here's the thing. Um, January, first of all, is the lowest earning month. So, like, I'm making less than I have since I started a year ago. Uh, which is fine. It's it's okay. It's not. I mean, this is my job, but at the same time, I know it's cyclical. But I have to. Oh, jeez, that was a big sneeze. Um, but what I was trying to say. Hold on. Just just because I can, and it looks cool. Um, yeah, I I had to, I do I do know I have a good bit of ads on my videos, but honestly, you know, I don't know. I don't I don't have like sponsorships. Like you know, go play Mobile Strike simulator 62 I don't know what it's called but you know maybe at some point I'll have those so I shouldn't rag on I don't know you know what I'm just I'm just doing my best guys if you don't want to watch me because there's too many ads I get it it's okay you don't have to watch me it's all good I won't think any less of you okay that looks pretty cool I think we could add even more texture but I think I think I'm gonna be going beyond what I need to do here Um. I know it's gross, but you don't want to hear that, but I'm sorry. I think one thing I do want to do... Nah. Hold on. <laughs> let me let me, let me, me get this right before I do something that just looks hideous. I want to make sure this is going to look good before I go all out on it. But let's see. I think if I put a staircase right here... Yeah. Because if it's just straight down to trap doors, it's almost like it's too thin. But when you have this little, uh, little stair on the bottom, it just kind of looks better. I can't be wasting trap doors either. These things are hard to make. I don't know. For some reason, I feel like they just take so many materials to make. Um, yeah, and then that's good right there. Um, but yeah, as far as how the front and back is going to go, I think I'm just going to leave it how it is. I've just tried to overstyle it maybe a little too much. And it doesn't even grow that much sugar cane. So, I mean, it grows two rows of like 23, so 46. It grows, so 46 per would be 92. It grows like 92 sugar cane times three, uh, which is 276. What's 93 times seven? Wait, what? <laughs> I don't even remember the number I was asking. Okay, I give up. Yeah, okay, something needs to be on the front of this, though. I think maybe like this. No, bad, bad, bad. We're doing bilateral supports, remember? <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what can go on the front. It just looks kind of just looks kind of weird right now. Hold on. I I can always solve I can always solve problems like this, you know, cuz I'm a Minecraft expert. Uh Okay, hold on. And then blop blop oh blop blop blop. Okay. 
Let's see, does this look any better? Um, you know what? Yeah, we're, 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 we're going to run with it just because I don't have any other ideas. I think it looks fine. Honestly, guys, there's so many ways I could do this that if I just keep going with it, I'm never going to end. And I think that that's, that's, yes, that is perfectly fine. It's not the most beautiful build in the entire world ever, ever, but it's okay. It's just a greenhouse in Minecraft. I do not want to have the stair in the middle, though, right there, if I'm going to be doing these uh, trapdoor dealies. Okay, boom, 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 boom. Oh, it's easy if I put one on the side to get up. It's actually really easy. I can just go like do do do. All right, so finally it's done after all that time. I do want to put some barrels, I think. Do I still need to extend these? No, I was going to leave these two uh, open right here just for some storage and stuff. Uh, but if I'm going to do some storage, I want to have these areas right here just be wood. Just like solid wood blocks like this. And I don't need a whole ton more, but we'll make a little bit. And then we'll go to this side and then do the same thing. I should probably also make where the door is be wood. Yeah, it might be nice. Some people said Neo under the glass. You really should change um, the material. I don't agree. I think it looks fine with dirt. It's just like because a, a greenhouse would be set on top of. <gasps> Man, that was weird. That was a weird hiccup. I mean, I guess usually, yeah, you wouldn't build a greenhouse on just dirt. But this is Minecraft, so, you know, creative freedoms, I guess. Anyways. Uh, barrels. You know what? I don't think we're going to need a whole ton. So I'll just put two barrels in each. I mean, honestly, the sugar cane's going to be put back in my house uh, more often than not. But yeah, now we have two pretty cool looking greenhouses and they are growing the sugar cane. So that is one project complete. We can run through and we can get some of it maybe. Actually, I want to make it grow all the way. But let's go check on our actual wheat farm because there's a ton of stuff growing in there. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Now I go over here, I see how much bigger of a scale of greenhouse this is. Like, this one's huge, and it grows a lot more. Uh, but to be fair, sugarcane's kind of odd, because you have to have water touching it, so it's kind of harder to design a greenhouse for, but I think we did okay. I think it's a pretty cool... Uh, we can pat ourselves on the back for a job well done. And uh, let's figure out what to do with the rest of the episode. I think first things first... Let's clean up this inventory a little bit. So we're going to go in our wood chest. Look at all these wood materials we have in our, just our inventory. Okay, that's nice. I'm going to get a glass chest going because we have a lot of glass. So I figure it needs its own chest. Oh, we didn't put any lighting. Aha. See, I knew we weren't done. You're never done in Minecraft. Uh, we need a little bit more coal. For oh, we already had coal. Okay. Then we need sticks. Perfect. Perfect. Boom, 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 boom. Nope, boom. Okay, let's see how many uh, let's see how many lanterns we can make with this. I can just do this, and then we can a whole stack of lanterns. That's perfect. And then you know what? The world's best contraption ever. Oh yeah, that's nice. Uh, let's make these back into just ingots, and then we'll put all this stuff up. I always have these extra ingots in my inventory. It's kind of bothersome, but at the same time, I mean, whatever. It's not really a big deal. Um, and then my buckets were in here. There's also clay in here. It should be in here. Okay. Let's go finish this out. I think actually we might need some fence too. Um, yeah. We may need a little bit more, so we'll craft some more. Not a whole ton more though. Um, the only reason I say we need some fence is like to hang the lanterns. But honestly, I don't even know if we have space in the build. But let's see. Let's run over there real quick and check it out. I may need to make some sort of path over to it. Uh, but for now, you know what? I don't mind running on the snow. You know, it has a nice, satisfying little noise to it. Um, but yeah, as far as lanterns go in here, man, that's a tricky one. That really is a tricky one. Because if you hang them down, it's like, ugh, it touches your head. Not the best method. Also, why is this all crunched up? Okay. And obviously, you can't put them, like, right there. Because then the sugar cane can't, can't grow. We've got a mess on our hands. Yeah, I don't I don't know where to put them. I really don't. If we had glowstone and make this a lot easier, hint, hint, maybe we should go to the nether. I swear we already went to the nether. Maybe not, though. Did we? But where would I have put the nether portal? Deep in the mine, maybe? I don't know. I honestly don't remember. That's kind of bad. I feel like I should be able to remember that. <sighs> okay, so as far as where to put the lanterns, I'm at kind of a loss here. I really don't know. 
I don't know if Sugar King grows in the dark, but I'd rather not have all this area in here be dark. But let me let me do some brainstorming. I'm sad to say my brainstorming came up with nothing useful. I think I'm just gonna have to do them like this. Not the best, but you know, it, it's honestly, it's it's not that bad. It'll be okay. It could be worse. We could have no lighting in here at all. I mean, you just can't run and jump through it, which I mean, that's not that big of a deal, I guess. I don't know. I just would prefer for them not to touch my head. You know, I could go with torches if you can place those on glass. I don't even know. You know you, I could have gone with torches, but lanterns, I don't know. They just look better to me. And I also need to expand where my lanterns are um, in my tree farm. Because the tree farm did expand. You can see I sort of adapted. Oh, they don't even use lanterns. Um, I sort of adapted the style of a little like planter just made it a little bit bigger which is cool I think it looks pretty 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 snazzy I guess I don't know it's not the best thing I've ever designed but it still looks good uh, I want to have torches around here just because I don't really want things spawning in the middle of the night around my trees and then subsequently killing me not the best move on my part if I die um, yeah that should be a good bit well, maybe like one right here I don't know where are some other dark zones uh, like right here oh right there yeah should be good um, I'm gonna go put the fence up and this barrel that's over near here because I always do need to expand my base a little bit or expand my base of operations as far as trees go so we'll put some fence in there um, we, we'll put a few torches in there just because we have some extra let's actually go start mining this because it looks like a lot of the ones on the right greenhouse which is the one we finished first is kind of done and the more I look at this greenhouse, the more I actually like it. And it's also good for sugarcane because when it's in an unenclosed space, you know, and you break it, the sugarcane can kind of fly off in every direction. And it's kind of a pain in the butt to gather. But in this, you know, it's kind of like a controlled sort of break. It has to go like either in the middle or into my inventory. So it's perfect. I like it. I've never had, I've never had greenhouses before this series. So kind of interesting to get those going. Look at that. Already got a stack and a half. All right, let's go back to the house, put up our inventory, and uh, call it an episode. So if you're still watching, you already know You already know the drill. You're the last 5% of people watching. So the secret code of the day, you can put it down in the comment section down below to show that you've watched most of the video. Secret code is going to be 3947. Again, that's 3947. So if you leave that down in the comment section down below, I will know that you watched most of the video. Um, and I'd be very appreciative. You'll get a heart on your comment. And you actually get a heart if you leave a comment, like, at all. You could literally say something. Like, you could just say something. You could like, just go, like, say something. Because I can spell. Um, but, yeah. I already... F hold on. But yeah, I literally forgot what the number I just said. But that's the secret code if you want to put it down in the down in the comments if you don't want to it's also okay um, but yeah a little progress update so we have uh, we have our house pretty much complete that's cool we've got a sugarcane greenhouse going we also have our beautiful and you know what we'll, we'll go in creative mode just for a second just so we can fly around and look at everything um, so we got this beautiful greenhouse which I really like the design on this it was hard to get a screenshot of it though um, and I like this design even more, I think. I don't know. Vote down below which greenhouse you like better. So do you like the sugarcane combo greenhouse? Or do you like this greenhouse better? Vote down below. Um, say sugarcane or wheat greenhouse. Whichever one. Um, this one could go for a little improvement. See, the only problem I have is like these are solid blocks. And I think maybe if they were stairs, the design would get across a little bit better from the front at least. Uh... You know what? Actually, I think that might fix the whole thing. We can try it. Look, here's the thing. It's not that big of a deal, guys. I can always put the, put these blocks back anyways. I just want to see, and I don't consider this cheating, when I look at it from the front. Yeah. You know what? We're going to go ahead. We're, we're just going to, and look, I'll even put back exactly what was there. So there's no funny business going on. We'll delete both of them. Um, let me just fly back to my house. We're going to go back into or survival mode. But yeah, vote on which one you like better. Game modes, bro. So the only reason I have like cheats enabled is literally so that I can fix, uh, or sorry, so I can take thumbnails whenever I need to take a thumbnail. It's so much easier to be able to fly and get an angle than like build up some blocks and do it. So I hope that that makes sense. Some people are like you don't need creative to take a, you don't need cheats to take a screenshot. You're right. I can always take a screenshot, like, but I can't take a good screenshot without them. 
because you have to be, you know, you have to have a certain angle. And I think we actually may be able to get up to all these. I think we can just... No? Wait. Yeah. And then we can just... No? Well, I'm confused. Okay, whatever. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. I need to get up here. I need to replace all these with stairs. The ones in the middle, not so much. But, like, this one right here has to be a stair now. Because I, I, I can't unsee it with the stairs. They look so much better. I like that. It looks so much smoother. And then this top one right here can honestly just be a stair like that. Okay, so I got to remember that. So hold on. We'll go to the other side. I'm not going to do the ones in the middle, just these ones. Honestly, you can't really see from the... Actually, nah, we'll, we'll, we'll do it on all of them. But I want to get these done first. Okay, I don't know if there's a way to get across here without falling in. I actually don't think there is. Okay, well, we'll break this here. We'll just continue to do this. If you guys are still watching, by the way... 3947. I'm kidding. But I know the secret codes may start to get annoying. But m most of it for me is just so that I can see how many people are watching how far. YouTube's, you know, analytics will tell me, you know, a good part of the story, but it won't tell me the whole story. Um, so I do appreciate I know people also skip around and it doesn't account for that. Like, it, I don't know how many people are just like skipping around. I have no idea. So a bunch of people could be skipping around in the videos, and I just have no idea. That's fine. I don't care about that. I also don't care if you don't want to watch my videos. I just, for those of you who do watch, I'm curious to see how far you watch, if that makes sense. So just know that I really do appreciate it. Anyways, guys, I'm going to end the episode here because it's a bit, bit long-winded now. It's It's been going on for quite a while. Thank you for watching episode 10. I really do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, then leave a like down below. If you didn't, don't leave a like. You can actually leave a dislike. But I do ask that, honestly, if you do leave a dislike, let me know in the comment section down below why you left a dislike so that hopefully I can earn a like from you in the next video. Um, and if you did not like the video, that's fine. You're allowed to not like things. No one can tell you what you do and don't like. Uh, don't let anyone ever try to tell you. Um, but yeah, if you didn't like it, let me know. And I'll try to make the next episode better, if I can. If you say, Neo, I didn't like the video because you're dumb. Obviously, that's not constructive at all. I'll just be like, no, you, lol. I'll, just, I'll literally say. Sometimes people are like, you. someone said you stupid. So I said, no, you. <laughs> I just think it's funny. Uh, but yeah, if you, if you have some real feedback, leave it down in the comments. I do appreciate any and all feedback. I try to keep my ear to the community just to see what everyone's saying, what everyone's thinking about my videos. Ah, yes, that looks much, much better. Oh, yeah. Well, let me know which greenhouse you guys like better. Uh, the wheat greenhouse or the sugar cane greenhouse. Let me know in the comments down below with that secret code, and I'll really appreciate you. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in episode 11. Bye.